Hello everyone, here is Martin with part number three of the Bactrian Kingdom campaign. Thank you all here for joining me here today. We'll continue where we left off. Um, not totally of course, but we're now just doing a siege of Pyrrha. I'm now pushing against those guys. <coughs> That's what we're now going to do. It should not be taking too long as a siege, but I could not out resort, uh, so I had to do it this way. So yeah, that is it. That is the beginning and thank you again for joining me here today. For all of you that have not yet seen any videos on the channel, um, at least that are not like as a seat recorded. Um, Happy New Year to all of you. Uh, of course, it's now January again. And I hope we can this year, hopefully, um, on the end of this year, have a thousand subs. That is my goal, I hope. Uh, very soon we hopefully will also hit 500 subs uh, anyway for all of you that have been here for all this time thank you again um <coughs> but without all you guys i wouldn't be here of course so thank you all thank you very much i would not be with youtube doing it but thank you again that is even if there is a small amount of people now watching it those people are the ones i'm doing it for right now so yeah and increasing it will of course help out as well and I must say, this mod has possibly done the most job for the channel right now. It's also possibly also the most popular thing on the channel. Um, yeah, for those of you that are also watching like uh, Medieval Kingdoms, uh, so well, yeah, I've been um, working on. I want to do it, but I have to. Um, for me, it is quite uh, being some difficulties because I've um, um, having trouble with uh, the fact that like when I install the mod, it basically overrides entire uh, Tila file, and when I'm <coughs> Like playing another mod, uh, the mod itself will uh, still be on it, like because it overrides um, when you install it um, in the mod. So, if anyone knows exactly how to do that correctly, I would like to know it so I can continue my Scotland campaign, what I enjoy doing. So, uh, of course, let me know. But for now, we're doing, of course, three. Um, um, we're doing now three yeah, of these videos, but was was almost good. But it shouldn't be taking that long. They're already being slaughtered by our own uh, foot soldiers and archers, so that doesn't seem to be too big of a deal. And of course, our Indians, like we already kill like 200 men or something, so that's also quite good. And the Torx sword should absolutely slaughter most of all these guys. Now just go attack. Because they're really strong. And these guys are bits, yeah, just weaklings. Not much to do for them. Now uh, let's fire upon those archers because the archers will do the most damage, I think. So over here, we just over here they can. Uh, <laughs> ah, they're still like a uh, firing point length range. <laughs> Alright, they should not be able to win that normally. Normally, I say. Oh, we're getting some reinforcements. If you can fire upon those guys, it should do that. But yeah, the archer is doing really good. Like, the archer really did want to be the better things of this entire army, I must admit. And that is actually like, quite true. They also like implement the uh, um, this guard mode on, on like a till uh, that would be also quite nice if they implement like but what they did with Rome 2 like I I get why you do it with the Rome 2 but why don't you just want implement that as well with the tiller? But it's so weird because right now it would be so nice just to be able to not have them pursue them all the time. But well, fortunately that's how that works. Can you actually fire? Yeah, you can. Good. Yeah, I suppose like a room fire on the backs.
Let's hold because otherwise it will be far too much friendly fire. How many kills? 170 kills. And these guys on two, oh no, 170 kills. I like these guys as well. They also doing t snish. They actually got quite a good of kill amount of kills, but uh, they're not really strong or something. But as long as they do their job, right? <laughs> as long as they do their jobs, then they're doing a good job. Yeah, you can hold. You can fall back now. Yeah. They can like uh, start climbing up, and these guys can possibly go down. Oh no, you don't need to do that. To be honest. Oh, they will go all down there, so they will go kill him anyway. Alright, that doesn't matter too much. Like I don't want them to go out here because before they are out the tower will collapse under them, so that's basically a death sentence. <laughs> yeah. You can better let the energy capture the tower than um, capturing it yourself. Like over here as so well, I don't really don't want to go down because that is just going to be so bad. Most of the archers have done like a really good job, so that is quite nice to see. And these guys can now start firing point blank upon the on the enemy general, I suppose. Gore, gore, and gore. They're actually in the formation, but it should do good. Right there. If they route, they route. Doesn't really matter too much. Now take this position. Thank you. And charge. I'm just going to let them find it out because they know they should be okay. Because we're now getting like flank fire. There's a whole lot of changed up around them. A bit more. I'm not sure how the uh, beamin did. I think they were gone. <laughs> Oops. Ah, uh, like it doesn't matter too much. Like I don't. It's a bit weird, but sure. A much better uh, position than that you can't really have, can you? I'm not sure if they're actually winning it, but we await your orders. Let's use some poison as arrows you as you to weaken them. Don't really seem they're like losing men that are rapidly. But they have now routed what should mean the end of it. So, how was that? That was the end of it. Let's hold. 
and see a butcher vest. Oh, nice. Like, I got. I, I'm not sure if I got an animation mod on, but I think I do, because otherwise you would not have that much animations. But I prefer, I must admit, I, I really prefer it because it does that better. And, like, if those. And this is also really more realistic, like, instead of them falling off like a dumb idiotic. Oh, 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 I've been hit. <laughs> I like it. That is not another thing that I always enjoyed. But it is preferable. It is definitely preferable. Actually, in these animations. Of course, they're not all similar, but they will like help me out. Oh, that was a nice one. Like some of these, like they're so good. That is good. And in the valley. That was the end of the Sally Should Rue in Pura. A decisive victory for the Bactrian Kingdom. Let's go and continue to the campaign map. There we are, we lost 133 men, we unfortunately lost the entire spearmen unit, but it doesn't really matter. Um, I suppose we could do that, but now let's just occupy the city. Or, we can actually use that 500 money actually quite a lot. Like, that is quite nice for the treasury. And with the rebellions we can deal, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, sanitation already, good. That is a perfect one. Over here we got another native cattle market. Let's actually bring on a good amount of food. So that's good. This one is not really useful, is it? No. What I wouldn't mind is know which one actually uh, provides me with the... What is it? Our... Uh, um, what is the word? Seed engines. Yeah, that one. Seed engines. Which one provides us with the siege engines? Like, should I just go and recruit more pikes? Yeah, I think I should get some extra pike units. Uh, maybe like get another torque short. No, we can't. We can't, we can't get that here, can we? Nope. Um, what we could go and get instead of the spears is just another. Um, it's more. Greek settlers, one of those, because those ones are just better. Can I get Greek settlers and Greek settler militia? These ones seem to be better, but they're not. Oh, they actually are, okay. But these ones, these ones are no real different, but they are less expensive. Hmm. But these ones as well, these ones are actually quite decent for the price, so let's get those ones instead. Alright, that is all. That and then our army is sort of ready. Although these ones are quite expensive, but we can afford it. So, like, it is now our Imperial Empire. Like, the sale issues are being actually basically trashed also by the Media Arab. Media Apartheid, what might be our next foe in the coming years. Mainly because of the fact that they are basically territory, taking territory that I want to take. So. Uh, that's basically the one <laughs> main reason. Um, yeah, the nominate as well, I suppose. I said, mm, where did they come from? Were they like re liberated faction? Because we got also nominate over here. That's uh, the normal ones. But yeah, the Egyptians are also doing a good job. I mean, actually, strength ranking six. That is quite bad. That's not bad. I think Rome is right now strength ranking one. I would think, but I'm not sure. But yeah, right now, I think after we're taking these settlements over here, I might just hold in for a peace duty for the moment. Um, because, it'll get rid of, uh, or a peace, at least start building up our empire, so we can have um, some good industry and a good um, income. Like, I will possibly take, like, a f uh, turns, like, don't showing it, or maybe, like, show a few turns of it, but not much. So, um, or I can move on, like, I, I don't think you guys want to see me... Like just ending turns and just building things up. Of course, I will talk about like around every five turns what I've done, but I don't want to go and yeah, just end turns and turns and uh, nothing happening. Like anything special, but like I'm building up the armies and doing that. But I will tell of course what happens in like yeah after that turn. But yeah, there's a bit of planning for this campaign after we're taking uh is he is he had this? No, I don't think we're actually going to take that. Um, I think we're going to take Sifra, 
and that will be it because Etias is like in a territory that I don't yet want to control basically because it's really uh, controlled by two other um, powers that will make it really difficult to start controlling so unless like our path uh, okay seems the backing king doesn't have yet chapter activities that's a bit unfortunate but sure um, loyalty, growth, noteworthy imperialism. Hmm. Well, anyway, let's enter. Uh, is it, who is this? Oh, uh, no, I'm going to intervene because he is. A, she's a really bad one because he's a, he's a governor. I don't want that at all. Um, I think we're going to build. What should we build? Here, I think food. I think food might be the one that to go for because we, or we could go for elephant because that will increase our trade value and the income, not quite a lot. Like, oh, around nine hundred. What is quite a decent investment for like four thousand. We might want to wait then. Um, because we also collect good with public order, so that's right nice. Um, also if we leave, so that's even better. No, oh, that was very close. I almost was at the point of getting. Getting something done. Um, oof. Do we got to any more forces? I don't think we do, do we? No. Like, this guy is. I'm really glad that he's not dead yet. Like, I'm really glad about that because he's 71. Jesus. Just, that is, like, quite a, quite a hell amount. Any marriages that we might want to do. The door is open to you. Like marriages. You know you of Before course you're a satrap of the Seleucid Empire. Welcome. The day is already hmm. over. Any more things? No, not really. Well, um we could build build something, but I think I will wait here for the animals. And then possibly build something with that will help with public order as well. We already got something like full public order over here though from culture. But our culture is not because dominant. But it's going up quite quickly so that's nice. Alright we'll see in a turn what we will do. I might actually just get some extra taxes in. Although in our main set in my main province we got a bit of a problem with native decontent. Yeah. Yeah, because it's not even really good back train yet. Doesn't doesn't make you unfortunate, a bit unfortunate, but sure. Okay. Common resistant to native command escalation. Hmm. And over here we actually doing quite good. Macedonian is really rising up quite quickly. Uh, but of course, um. Yeah, we're actually getting also growth right here, so this is quite nice. If we do that like here, I'm not sure we need to, I think we need to build it on the one up first. But like, the little, little fertility is helping us quite a lot with food. Just a little bit more fertile. Because otherwise the region is like really shitty, I'm, I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, otherwise there's nothing. Uh, <laughs> unless you got no fertility whatsoever. Uh, like two, one. All right, so that's not too bad. Like, if we really want to go to filter region, we have to go like towards Syria and Mesopotamia. Uh, so it depends a bit. I think I might actually like vassalize these regions over here because they're like sort of centralized. Uh, glass is not really imp imp too important of a resource, so that shouldn't be too bad to miss out on. With like slaves and um, because it's slaves and marble are really handy to get, so those ones are possibly go to after, especially the slaves in Sifra. After we take Harmosia, anyway, let's go and end turn and I'll be back or in the siege because um, I don't think it will be happening much except that I'm going to build like the elephants over here, so that's a bit all that will happen. So, anyway. Let's see you in a second. Oh well, here we are. We're actually going to fight a battle. I thought this was actually a normal, uh, thought it was supposed to be a siege battle, but not really. It's going to be a normal one, so that's quite nice. We can attack them right away. So, Parks come over here, and these all can go over here. 
like this or something. I don't know, I don't really care too much. So, group. Battle group ready and awaiting orders. So. Alright, that makes them ready to go. Come on, okay, right. Okay, over here we don't have these guys. Uh, just. Shoot him a lot, just over here. Another group, and on this group. Battle group ready. Happy to serve Rome. Alright, everyone is running to the position because running should not be the priority here, but sure. I think I could easily smash them to bits, although they move them cavalry. Kind of really. I'm not sure if they are. Melee cavalry. Yeah, it's not really helping. Oh, oh, better shot than that you could not have. Like, really. Absolutely butchered. Yeah, they're not the Roman soldiers, but sure. God damn it, you idiots. Why did you not run? Oh, we even got the most opposition, it seems. <laughs> oh, we're getting the fierce, the uh, don't want to get shots. Ugh. It's not it. Ah, uh, that's going to be annoying because they didn't, they're not going to land until a long, long time. Uh, actually, uh, because he's alone, where are you, Calvary? Yeah, get him. What? Okay, they almost captured it because they're still firing at him. So, please, hurry up. Hey, yeah, horse! Yeah, come here if you hear you. <laughs> oh, that is a perfect position. <coughs> Much better than that you can have. You can fire that, right? Oh, these are the passports, Amiga. No wonder they're having such difficulties. Although they're holding actually sort of decent in the face of overwhelming opposition. Ah, uh, 
they should not actually be that close. If I'm not mistaken, right? I'm going to block this off. Oh, actually, no, I have to. Ah, perfect. Any one yet close down? Okay. We await your <laughs> I can laugh about that. <laughs> That's quite good. Thing is, like, if you go over here, we totally have those guys locked in. They shouldn't really, really come or go. They should be able to go anywhere. <coughs> But, oh, uh, don't break, don't break, don't break. Ah, back here, don't break. Come on. No, they won't. I don't think they will. Over here we won the main engagement. And over here we definitely going to win that. About by really breaking a switch. I would say. But yeah, capture it. Well, that was that. Okay, the last one. I'm not sure how the Argent doing, but everyone can hold. Oh, actually, the Argent I got something for you. Uh -huh. I'm not sure what these guys are doing, but you can go ahead and go over here. Try and fire from those guys. Because I want to be good for much else. Yeah, okay, capture that one. And over here we are. Already captured the thing, man. Chill. Yeah, thank God. Was that it? Yeah, that should be it. Nice, Liam. Right, that's all. They're actually going to land. Oh, look at that. That's easy. Alright, let's fast forward because this is going to be a long, long, long wait. Oh, that! Oh, what? Disbanded them? Oh, well. What 
really the idea I have in mind, but sure. Sure, sure. <laughs> I'd be absolutely murdered. But it, although it should, it should be fine in the zone. But sec. Ah, fuck it. No, 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 no. I don't know why I told you to do that, but well, sorry for that. Not my intention. If you will, come on, hurry up. Move your positions. You have to go and start firing on that idiot. If he year. Ah, oh, we actually didn't lose that much. Did we? Oh, he's actually going to land. Oh, no, he's not going to land. He's just going to go away again. Ugh. Well, when this guy is done, I will be back into the campaign map because it's... Oh, well, easy. Thank you much, game. Okay? Thank you much. All right. Let's end it there. It was the battle. I'll see you on the campaign map. Well, there we are. Hello. Let's go. And we won quite decisively again. Um, should we just sack it? Yep, we should just sack it, shouldn't we? Screw the rebellion. That will be okay. A megapolis. That's quite good for us. Ooh. Hmm. Yeah. Royal capital. Can it is it the same with the Ro as with the Romans? Which one? Um like which one of these like brings up um artillery? One of these ones should do that as well because I wouldn't mind a piece of dinner day. Nope. The Romans got it with this one. Hmm. Gymnastium now. Um Emporia Sota, maybe. No. Okay. What will then be? What will do it? Okay, which one is the one that we need then? Uh, ah, this one. Well, we need iron for it. Alright. So we need iron. And we don't have iron, do we? Nope. Okay, that's great. Um, I don't know why I want that one. It doesn't really seem to be anything good. Mm, not really. Let's just destroy it. Um, like we don't have enough money, unfortunately, because I have to go over and repair it, and for some reason we're also losing money, I, I don't know really who how. Seems these, oh, possibly because of our new expensive units. Ah, well. Ah, that regard, um, yeah, these ones will rebel, these ones will too. Over here we're gonna five thousand, but uh, is that army like seventeen thousand? Is, is that is is it is that expensive? Are these guys that expensive? Like is it army that expensive? You're saying that to me, right? Like because or we could take a look on how our provincial act costs. Hmm. Yeah, that might actually be true. Now think of it. Because of the fact that, like, we got over here, we got um, something doesn't really is good in giving us any money. Now think of it. Like this one is not giving us us to anything. Like if we would have like getting this one, it would also not help. Although it would give us the hoplites and things that we actually need. But like then this one would be far better. It would give us like the income that we need. The thing is, like, we have really much expensive, like, especially with this new thing, it's also giving us, like, uh, extra 
money reduction um, over here it seems this is also uh, not yeah they give us money but not much over here this is like this is costing 2000 so that's also quite a lot of money this one is also again costing us a lot of money this one as well but like we don't have a repair so it won't give us any money at the moment but expenses it will and over here we are of course making money that's all good over here we are yeah like this also again costing 600 money uh costing also like 600 so yeah we're just making expenses we can't really afford basically but uh that means we have to go and push up on the tax a bit Ah, we you know what? I think we can afford it for now. Uh, at some point, we'll have to go back here as well to repel the rebellion. This rebellion will happen first, so we'll push the push up to Alexandria and what is over here. We'll get the f this rebellion, so that we'll go there actually after this turn. Like this one as well. Like it doesn't really help out, does it? Although it helps with growth. But we don't actually get because of the taxes right now. But anyway, we need the money at the moment to get again done expend, uh, expend it again, get money from different things, and that will be able to help us getting money, and then can we reduce taxes as well? So of course, getting the really matter, you can quell them quite easily, and it also helps out with quelling the rebellion afterwards because you will get some uh, positive. Uh, yeah, a positive relationship from it, and also you will get experience from it by fighting them. And uh, yeah, that should be fine. Like if we go up to Bersius and then we push out towards um, over, hopefully one of these provinces. I don't hope it will happen here because we will have to then possibly go two turns before we are at Pura. I'm not sure how many turns that actually is. It might be actually one turn, and I think I did this walk in like a turn. I'm not sure, but yeah. We'll see. We'll see what the rebellions happen. Unless we have sort of the same uh, bug that we had with the uh, Archaic Dynasty or the Parthian Kingdom, where we didn't have rebellions when we should have had one. What also would be preferable, but at the moment we still have gotten every time. Oh, he is dead. Oh my god. That is not the best moment for that, I must admit. Um, actually, we should actually make uh, the one that is. Occupant foreign territories, influence, split swordsmen, melee bodyguards. Oh, shots! Oh, yeah, okay. Um, that shouldn't be too easy. We should actually make him uh, kick him out, out into the province right away, and then making him army general. Because right now we're losing food and uh, money because of he doesn't, that, uh, that guy doesn't have any trades. Okay, kick him out. Um, okay, that should have put him out of that idea, and uh, we have to put in another one in, although we can possibly do the one that we have here, but then um, we also have to wait a turn for it. The pleasure is of my mm. household. Try with these guys. The guards will have me listen. No. Um, yeah, now we're going to have some problems right away. Gee. Oh, it's also winter, so it sort of makes sense that we don't have money. That's not too great, but... Um, should we make a farm? Yeah, here we can ba build a farm. Over here as well. We should build the elephant, like, that will help us out quite a lot of money, so... Although, that won't be really afforded. Okay, we can build a fo uh, the elephant one this turn. Um, we could... Yeah, we could actually, maybe... Disband one of these units at least, then we could afford it maybe. So, well, that's fine. We could easily recruit them back, so it should not be too big of a deal. And overall, well, these ones, yeah, these ones will help with it. Um, what I'm going to do though is I possibly go over here um, and I'm going to raid because that will not make these ones um, starting to hate one another. <coughs> Or uh, start to stop the starving. Um, yeah. Okay, he's gone now, so we can still replace this guy. Give him the title of this province region. Public order taxes. We should actually not go for that. Go for this one. Yeah, let's go for that one. 
I think that might need now be better because the public order will also can increase from that one and also the state influence I don't know why I never got this one on why did I have to do that that is actually really bad like that is giving me oh my dad that's a stupid idea of me I shouldn't have done that uh, that has been costing me like 10% of all my upkeep and that was cost that is means 500 turn every turn I lost 500 income because of that edict oh my god that's so stupid of me Sorry about that. Oops. <laughs> well, anyway, let's go. End turn. Got a rebellion, of course. That was uh, Macron. Boris Macron again. Macron. Macron. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh, sorry that. Oops. I shot. Uh, it doesn't seem to be got actually rebellion in Macron. So that is. Uh, yeah, great. Seems to be something to do with this province that it doesn't really work. So that's good, uh, I suppose. Um, right now, oh, this guy is so bad. I'm really happy about the fact that I made um, my son and heir ready for this task, basically. Um, no, no, um, no, no, no. Do we have to go here? No, or here? Is that here we're facing? No. Yeah, replace this general with our son in the air. And that should help out uh, quite a bit, but not enough. Holy shit. That guy did more for our empire than I actually thought. Jeeb. Not good. Hmm. Haha. <laughs> so I have to be starting to disband uh, like uh, micro units like this one. Holy shit. Polarity, no thank you. Yeah, I don't even got these either. Well, that is a that is a pain in the balls. <laughs> oh crap. Yeah, I can all see like how much that changed it. I can't just afford this much. I really can't. Ah, fucker. Hey, buggies. Hmm. Wait. Well, that was a, this is a bit of a surprise for me. I, uh, I must admit, I didn't expect that our generals, our king, to have having such an impact on the income of our kingdom. Like, really? That high? Ah, sure. But we're now making a profit again, so at least we are in the good. Unfortunately, <laughs> this uh, guy is taking the province that I really wanted. I really, like, if it isn't even helping out, I'm just going to destroy it because it's final income that I need. Same over here, like, this is really much. This is overdoing it, right? It definitely is. Like, we got 9 uh, sanitation, so decreasing it, it will cost me like 400 less like that is again like 500 income that I could spend on something else and that will make us income go up again what I would like to spend on like this as well but I think the elephant one is the one that we need because it just gives us like 900 extra coin so that means that uh, we're going to be having a stand still the most magnificent for the moment to you and your honorable people what wisdom do you have? Yeah, for the moment it will give us a little bit of a stop. I will be a patient but it will help out in the end. Come, yeah. my friend. Speak. Why not? We are Just have trade, maybe. Stop it. Ah, <sighs> non aggression and trade. Speak. Low chance. Why and don't I you want to trade? Yeah, we don't have actually got any real good um, trade. I welcome you, Thanks. worthy speaker. The spirits have noticed that our treasure stores are wanting. Can you help with this small matter? Well, at least we've got some mana cushion packs. On per on per fronts, I do need it, so sure. And over here and over here, we're going to have rebel until I have to go and quell. All right, not so good. Well, anyway, let's enter and see what happens.
Okay, we're slowly but surely making a profit, so at least that's good. We got a in Carazan and Paris. Paris is in here. We don't actually got elbows. We actually don't got any, so at least that's good. Um, I think what we can do to get some extra money in the coffers is um, going over here, but do it on the raiding base so we at least make money. Um, like over here, go to Easy Bus and then just uh, sack it and then liberate a faction. I suppose that might be our best option there because right now, with our money, um, I don't I don't really want to take that because it just not will help me too much. In the fact that it will actually give me more cost than I really need. So yeah, um, over here. Uh, over here, can we, yeah, this Bovard dice. Oh, I don't really want to build anything here because it is a really good dice. Over here, we don't have anything that we can do because of the taxes. And uh, we're also losing food. So, I think over here we can build another food building. More like that. Or, which one of you is gives me the animal husbandry one? Yeah, this one does that. Let's build that over here. Yeah, that will give me a little bit of food. So, okay, that's fine. Unfortunately, that guy is taking that one. It's a bit annoying, but well. Uh, we have to deal with it. Slowly but surely, we'll be getting. Uh, I'm actually going to replace the guy that is here because I'm, I'm not sure. Yeah, this one is not so good. I know the one that I can get here is uh, quite a lot better. Point a new one. You are really good because you've got a really good amount of. Uh, is it popularity and for like things like that is that's quite nice I don't really need to make you this, do I? Although, why not? That should be fine. Uh, that helped actually out with the public order, so that's quite nice. Oh, native this one, 10 is so bad. Oof. But, like, we only got 27%, that's nothing, so that is uh, quite having that, uh, that province, but I'm not sure how good this, pro this settlement is. It shouldn't be too bad. Shouldn't be too good, so. We'll push there, and then we'll see what happens. Like after that, I don't think I will be doing much. I think I will be building up. So um, I, this will be should be a normal siege, but you have seen like in this episode as well. So I will possibly get that out. Um, I will take a look how long we're going. Otherwise, I will be coming back when we are a uh, few turns ahead. So we'll be back in a second. Um, I have to see we are like at 40 minutes, 30, 30 minutes or 15 minutes. So that means I'm going to quit the recording here. Next time we will be having quite a lot more money and income. I'm going to build up the uh, kingdom. And when I'm back, um, yeah, I will tell you what I've done, and then we will possibly push towards the uh, Media Upper Ten faction and the uh, yeah Kingdom of uh, Selge Kingdom and the Nominate and all those guys over here. So anyway, thank you all for joining me here today. If you think I deserve a like, please leave a like down below, and I see you all in the next one. It was here of Martin, and see you all later. Bye bye.